here we are up in our roof today, uh, looking at rooftop units. Uh, we got a condensing unit here. Uh, it's actually a York condensing unit. Uh, we're going to show you how easy it is to measure a coil for a replacement. Uh, the first thing you want to do is come over to this side. We're going to take off this panel and give us access to the headers and return bins. It's not coming out. Once we get in, in here behind this panel, we'll be able to see the headers and the return bins. What we have here is our line in and line out, as well as our return bins. This is a one row coil. As you can see here, it's got about a quarter inch flange, so it can connect to the actual unit. So the first thing we want to do when measuring a coil is obviously uh, write down the tube size. One way you can do, you can get the actual tube size is with this handy little tool we have here that can tell you the tube diameter. You just simply take it, place it up here, and see that that's 3 8 inch uh, OD tubing. When you're all wrapped up, the last thing you want to do is go ahead and put your panel back on. If you can get it in there. Just line up the screws, screw holes, and button her back up. If you're watching this video, you probably have a need for a replacement coil. If you have any questions or need any help measuring your coil, give us a call today. We'll be glad to help you or assist you. Uh, one of the best things about what we can do is we can build you an exact fit coil at a fraction of the price and we can get it to you in a fraction of the time as opposed to going back to the original manufacturer.